and I brought him to the Presbyterian Church. He had a wild meeting that night. It was wild. That was the wildest thing they ever seen. Boy, the pastor called me in the morning and said, you, gotta, you can't come back. If he comes back, I won't have a church left. So we went the Holiday Inn. And guess what we did is we went the Holiday Inn on that Wednesday. He said, the World Series is on tonight, and I love baseball. And I thought, the prophet likes baseball. <laughs> you know, I thought if you knew Jesus, baseball, fun, everything's out. It's just holy, holy, holy stuff. <laughs> oh, man. No, he likes baseball. Man, and we go, we sing like this. He gets up to preach about 10 minutes into his message. He goes, hey, Reggie Jackson just knocked the home run. Scores one or nothing. <laughs> Went right on preaching like it was nothing. I looked in my Bible trying to find Reggie Jackson, but <laughs> couldn't find it. About 15 minutes later, Reggie Jackson knocked another home run. The score's two to nothing. Holy Ghost giving him the score, inning by inning, <laughs> as he preaches. That's hard on a religious brain, man. Whoa, I loved it. Thank you, Jesus. That was 1978. 